guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a Scentsy haul. I did pick up a bunch of bars during their clearance event. So yeah, I'm really excited to sniff all of these with you guys and share my first impressions. Okay, so starting off, I am actually super low on my wax stash right now. I was trying to go through all of my summer scents um, just so I can start buying for fall because I know the new catalog comes out in August and I plan on buying fall scents come August 1st. So I did plan um, ahead and bought a few more to last me through the summer. And then most of these are fall and winter. So let me get into the summer ones first. I'm gonna start with pink sugarberry mint. And this one's a beautiful like bubblegum pink color, so pretty. So this one was supposed to be, I think strawberry and mint. It smells so good. It honestly does kind of give me bubblegum vibes. And I only get like a slight twinge of mint, not a lot. Mm, it's super sugary sweet, really yummy. So excited for this one. And then I did also get Pina Colada Cha Cha, which I've heard so much good things about. It's like this white wax and I figured Pina Colada would be perfect for the summertime. Literally smells like a Pina Colada. So much good coconutiness. Mm, that is so yummy. So. That's the other one. Now I'm gonna get into the fall scents that I bought. The first one being Cozy Chai, which is this beautiful like butterscotch color, I would say. And this one I've already sniffed because I was like, really excited. Oh, it smells so good. Literally like if you've ever had the chai tea concentrate, that's what it smells like, but with a little more like cardamom and ginger. Like not quite like the chai you would eat, but more like chai spices, if that makes any sense. But smells so good, I'm so excited for that one. And then honey pear cider, which again is pretty much the same color, this like butterscotch color, really, really pretty. I definitely get cider and I think the honey note makes it a little like sweet cider. Mm smells delicious. I can see this one being one that I could even melt in like August when it's still kind of hot, but I'm trying to get into the fall mood. I think this one will be really good. And then I did get two Halloween scents. The first one being Ghostly Greetings and it has this beautiful little like ghost pattern on it. So cute. And it's this like dark purple wax, really pretty. This one surprised me because it kind of is cologne-y. Um, Ryan, my boyfriend said that it actually smells like old lady, which I don't get old lady. I do get kind of cologne though. Let me smell the bottom. Oh, and on the bottom I get a lot of like grape or like some sort of berry, some sort of dark berry. Yeah, that smells really, really good though. Excited for this one, October. And then I did get Halloween Town from the Nightmare Before Christmas collection and it's this like light purple color. I did have this last year and I really enjoyed it. Kind of just smelled like candy to me, but now it smells like caramel apple to me. So, oh, it smells delicious. Definitely taking me back to last fall. So yeah, really excited to have that one. And then I think, oh no, this one was a random one. Um, I did get this Bring Back My Bar Peppermint Dreams, which sounded absolutely delicious. It's this white wax. It smells like a peppermint patty. Oh, it smells so good. Just like chocolate peppermint. Super excited about this one. Smells amazing. I'm so happy that I was able to get my hands on this one. And then I think, and I don't remember exactly because I did this purchase like really fast. I was just really trying to check out before anything got out of stock. But I think this whole last piece this whole last like group of items that I got was in a Christmas in July like box together. It was like a bundle, that's what it was. It was a bundle together and I can't remember the price of it for the life of me, so I'll put it on the screen. But I wanna say it was like $30 for all these bars or 25 or something like that. It was a really good deal. So I'm gonna get into them, but they're all Christmas scents. So the first one is Christmas Cuddles with this beautiful, beautiful like Christmas themed 
packaging. It's so pretty and it's like this wine mulberry color. Mm. Oh my gosh. Super spicy. A little bit like maybe cranberry or something or chutney. <laughs> Smells really good and definitely reminds me of Christmas, but I can't put my finger on the notes of that one. This one is Hollyberry Cinnamon, which is just this beautiful green, deep green wax. Which, mm, not the biggest fan of the scent. It kind of is very cologne-y, but I can't really put my finger on exactly what the scent is. Maybe some pine or something in there, but interesting one. That one is definitely gonna be saved for Christmas time because I can't imagine that any other time. I have a Christmas cactus, which was surprising to see. It's like this light green color. It's very fruity. It smells like prickly pear if you've ever had like a prickly pear margarita or something. That's what it smells like. It smells super good. I could see myself just burning this right now. Next one I have is Candied Cranberry Pecan, which sounds absolutely amazing. It's this beautiful red wax. Oh yeah, I definitely get the pecan in that one in Candied Cranberries or Candied Pecans. It smells delicious. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. That one's gonna be amazing. Probably pull that one out in November, actually, instead of waiting till December. And then I have Pretty in Plaid, which I know was a big scent last year. And it is in this green wax. So it has red packaging, but green wax. That's the first time I've seen them do something, uh, a color that's not the same as the packaging. This one smells super fresh. Like, I think it's supposed to be some sort of wintry pine. Really, really fresh scent. So this one will probably have to go in like the bedroom, I think, because I don't usually do fresh scents downstairs, but it smells pretty good. And then I have Snow Kissed Cranberry, which is also in a beautiful like holiday packaging and this like dark red scent. Oh yeah, that's a beautiful fruity cranberry note. And I'm smelling like cranberry leaves or like sage leaves or something at the bottom there. So that's an interesting one. It's like fruity, but a little bit fresh. And then I have Slay All Day, which is this really cute, it has like wind packaging in this light blue wax. Ooh, that is icicles. That smells like, like a fir tree, like a tree farm. Wow. Ooh, that one is super fresh. So that's a nice like tree scent. That'll be really good right around Christmas. And then I'm Snow Over It is the last bar that I have for this haul in a beautiful baby blue wax. That one's a little fresh. I feel like that has like citrus in it. It kind of smells a little orangey. Mmm. I can't put my hand on what that one is, but very citrusy and fresh. And this could be like a good January scent is what I'm imagining it for. But yeah, that was the last of the Scentsy bars that I got. So I'll put my total up on the screen. I think I did really good. I love they did like a little Christmas in July bundle. I think that was so smart of them. Probably also helped them get rid of some back stock that they had, but I was happy to buy that. <laughs> and I was really happy to get my hands on a few Halloween scents before they actually come out this year. So that was super fun and super excited to have Peppermint Dreams in my collection and get to try that out. So that's everything for this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down below if you participated in the Scentsy clearance event or if you're waiting until August 1st to get your hands on the new stuff, which I definitely am excited to get my hands on some new stuff. So thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.